As part of efforts to ensure free, fair, and credible elections in 2023, the United Nations Development Program, UNDP, in collaboration with Sida Seed Foundation, has charged Nigerians to desist from vote buying. They gave this advice at the sensitization of 3,000 electorates on voters' education in the Zango Kataf Local Council in Kaduna. Plus TV correspondent Habila, Habila's report is presented from our studio. In every democratic election, voter and civic education are necessary to ensure that the electorate understand their rights to vote. Speaking of this exercise, the team member of the foundation, Paul Ayes, says the cardinal aim of the program is to reawaken political consciousness and participation of the local communities. He says the political space is meant for every citizen, not for the men alone. Noting that youth and women can aspire to any position. While lamenting the high number of vote buying in communities, he advised the residents on the dangers of the act. We want to see women in the, for, uh, in the forefront, you know, making decisions on behalf of other people, so also with persons with disability, because these people have a lot in them that have been undermined by people. But this time around, we are making the sensitization to see how people in all walks of life will help these people bring out those virtues that God has embedded in them so that we can have a developed Nation. They also called on youth and women not to allow themselves to be used by politicians as their voters' card is their right and power to bring about good governance in the country. Well, I don't see need for being violent and um, allowing anybody to use you to achieve whatever selfish interests you have. At the end of the day, after using you for whatever you want and you will just dumb you there. Even the youth, I, I don't expect in 2023 we'll see, we experience Togri or... Some of the participants expressed delight on the sensitization. In the next three months, we are, we are expecting the, that Nigeria will go into another session of a election. So we encourage the government to involve women in all things, in all activities that will take place. Involve women. And we are assuring you that the sky is going to be the limit for Nigeria. The number of women in our polity, there are few women in the politics. They don't, the women do not put themselves into the politics. I'm advising we women should put our hands together to work so that we see our country moving. They insist that for Nigeria to get it right, INEC and other agencies must continue in sensitization of the local communities on the new electoral act and the use of BVAS. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.